Hi everyone, it's Elaine Biz, and today we have another unboxing of some uh, Blackwing Palomino pencils. And um, this is my second review of these pencils. I've already opened this box for you on camera. I believe that on the other video, I said that they only have like three different kinds of pencils, but turns out that they have many different kinds of pencils. So um, with that said, these are the three I'm going to concentrate on because they're the ones that are made for artists. This one is the one I use for events and um, these are these are really made for uh, illustrating. It has it's a soft graphite so I mean, it's a no-brainer. I've already these two confuse me because one is really meant for long writing which means uh, like if you're a writer and you really don't uh, this was at the time where type, typewriters were your computer uh, in your pencil and paper was where you jotted down notes and, and you develop your story. It's not just for drawing, but also for people who uh, compose music, they recommend this pencil. This is the pencil that you would have used in order to write and to write for long periods of time. So, um, I haven't opened these, I opened this one, but they come exactly like this from Amazon. There will be a link at the bottom of the description. I also bought a, a Blackwing pencil sharpener. And, uh, and I'm gonna make another video on the importance of having a good pencil sharpener because uh, as much as you think, oh, well, you know, any any pencil sharpener will do, trust me, that is not the case. The fancier the pencil, the more likely you are uh, to need one of these. And uh, just to give you an example of how valuable these pencils are, in the 90s, people used to pay $40 for one pencil because they were out of production. They stopped producing them and they started producing them about eight years ago. So this particular one right here, it is the favorite pencil of Chuck Jones. And for those of you who are too young to know who Chuck Jones is, Chuck Jones is the uh, animator for Bugs Bunny, Merry Melodies, and Looney Tunes. And he did so for many, many years. So. We're going to open these babies up. And these average $22 to $23 a box. So once again, these are not for students, but that doesn't mean you can't splurge one day. So we've already opened this one, but I'm gonna open it again. And they come with these black rubber bands. Okay, so I'm actually surprised that they look like this. So there's 12 per box, and this is actually the, uh, the ferrule, it can be open. The ferrule is this area here. And this can be open and you can replace the erasers. So that they do sell you erasers separately. Now this one, I was painting. They said they had a gum metal finish and that's a real, that's a really neat finish, that's for sure. I wanna try that again. So here's the um, Palomino. And this it says 602. I'm not exactly sure what the weight would be, like if it's like a 2H or anything like that. I know this is closer to a 6B, this this one. But um, I don't know what this one would be. I think this one is an HB, but that remains to be seen. 
So again, this is really nice. Now these these look nicer than these ones for some reason. They look like they've been through heck. So here's the three pencils um, that I just got. And oops. So here are the three pencils and uh, I want to show how they look and this one is my favorite. It is graphite, it's supposed to be the, it's just the soft graphite and it's called a black wing. It's just the Palomino black wing as you can see here. And um, this one, uh, whenever you write, it has a matte finish and it's really good for illustrating. I, I love that look of like it, it'll actually pick up the pressure of whatever it is um, it, it makes it just makes I believe I said this before but it I just feel like it makes the line work look good even if it's not perfect it just makes it look good And the erasers are nice, it they will pick up. Here they go. They're really nice. So there's that one. The 602 features half the pressure, twice the speed, and it even says it right on the pencil. I don't know if if you can see it. Hmm. So what it does is it makes it really easy for you to write uh, if you had to write a letter or anything like that or if you were taking notes. And I do feel like I'm not using a lot of pressure so. Actually, I'm kind of just pinching the pencil in between my fingers. And here is the um, the pearl, and this is supposed to be a medium, I guess. Uh, it has a balanced graphite, so it's not too hard or too soft, and it's perfect for writing, composing, and uh, drawing. Uh, I haven't used this one a lot. It's uh, because I, I really like these two. So let's let's play with this one a little bit. I 
I, I just you have to appreciate the lines how it it's for, it's forgiving I love that aspect of it you can it's And it's not a, it's not necessarily because it's made of a particular wood or anything like that, but it's it's made um, with the end purpose in mind. So whenever you know whenever pencils are made, they're for writing. But whenever these pencils are made, they're for a specific reason. They they the lead has been balance for a specific reason the, the lead might be softer in some pencils for a specific reason the lead might be harder in order for you to write uh, to make it easy for you to write I, I love this not necessarily the hairy line look but I, I love sketches like this because they remind me of French little sketches um, but I you know if I if I were to recommend these I would definitely recommend these pencils they're I think they're amazing like I said this one I already use this type of pencil I already use in my event um, if I if you are starting out and you want to see which pencil you like best there is a kit that actually brings two of each of these as long as well as uh, a pencil sharpener and a point guard it, it actually comes with little caps that will protect your um, the points on your pencil so I highly recommend getting that kit and the kit if you were to buy the pen, uh, 12 of each pencil uh, the pencil sharpener and the point the 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 guard caps uh you're looking at about a hundred a hundred and ten dollars probably around that but if you just buy the kit the kit is about 35 so you get to experience a really high quality pencil without having to break the bank and if you are getting paid to do a job well this is exactly what you want to use so um, I hope you enjoyed my review of these pencils. There are links below for you to uh, buy them if you would like. The links are affiliate, so they help me out. Um, as you know, my channel is not monetized, so it helps me continue to buy goodies and share them with you. If you like what you saw here, please give it a like, comment, and subscribe. And now go make something couture.